Tuberculosis is a highly contagious disease common in the tropics caused by the germ called Mycobacterium tuberculosis. This germ was discovered in 1882 by a microbiologist named Robert Koch, who also discovered its vaccine. TB, which can hurt a person's lungs and also cause damages to some parts of the body if not detected on time and treated. Although a lot of people have identified TB with cough, but this doesn't mean that any time you have cough, you have contaminated the disease, as TB is said to be accompanied with peculiar signs and symptoms. The signs or symptoms of uh, tuberculosis, one, uh, yeah, people cough, there are different cough, different degrees and levels of cough, but if one is coughing persistently for three weeks, two to three weeks, there's a need for that person to see a doctor. Whether a child, adult, male, female, coffee, coffee constantly for two weeks, there's the need to see a doctor. Um, if this cough is accompanied with fever, or during that period, you know, there's high fever, and then um, also uh, the possibility of chest pain. You know, while the person is coughing, has chest pain, and um, start feeling the pain around across the chest, could be a sign, could be a sign also, and then. Coughing blood, then you know a lot of pressure around the chest, around the throat. So the person may start coughing blood and um, weight loss, start losing weight, and all this. Uh, these are these are possible signs, uh, symptoms of uh, tuberculosis. And then uh, we cannot uh, say that that person has tuberculosis. These are just uh, become a TB suspect. Then until there is a medical examination to verify actually what the actual cause could be. But these are generally. Uh, possible symptoms and signs of uh, TB. Nigeria currently ranks fourth among countries with the highest TB burdens in the world. Despite the poor awareness of the disease in the country, it is good to know that people have an idea of what the disease is all about. Tuberculosis is, is caused by Mycobacterium tubaco. It's a problem now in our generation because a lot of people eat outside, a lot of people are infected, they don't know. And another problem is that it's an aftermath of HIV AIDS because what people with HIV AIDS tend to come with one of this infection at the later end of that HIV AIDS and these are one of the infections they get as a result of HIV virus. The society has been plagued by TB for a long time and uh, it's a disease that has no respect for gender, whether you're a man or a woman. And uh, when you get in contact with tuberculosis, it takes quite some time to eradicate. But it's not an easy thing to deal with. Tuberculosis is a disease that affects people's lives, like cough, that makes people to be slim. Tuberculosis is a deadly disease. I've seen people who are infected uh, with uh, that disease and uh, that uh, claim they are alive. However, TB, which is also linked with HIV, has also become a leading cause of death in many developing countries. Unlike HIV, which has no cure but can only be managed, tuberculosis is a curable disease which can be treated. WHO strategy for treating TB, that is what is called uh, the DOTS. Directly observed treatment short course. You know, it's eight months. It's long. Some people, after taking it, may feel that okay, and then abandon it. That will result to another issue on tuberculosis, uh, drug resistant uh, tuberculosis. So because of that, or the should be default because it's a long period, it's a long time. Default people can move from one place to the other. You know, and without proper reference. Or referral, or by the health, uh, by the health personnel, or by the uh, TB patients, not giving adequate information of where he's relocating and all that stuff. You know, these are challenges. Uh, so the dot actually is directly observe treatment shortcuts. It's a strategy by WHO um, that should be used to treat tuberculosis. Perhaps you're asking this question already. When can I go for a TB test? This should be done if you have been in contact with one who has TB or if you're experiencing some of the TB symptoms mentioned, if you're infected with HIV. But it is advised that mothers immunize their newborn babies with BCG from birth to 15 days after they have been born. This is so as to give them immunity against tuberculosis.